Hello? Dad, Uncle Cho prepared lots of roses for Mom, and he also wanted to have dinner at our house. Come to our house quickly. Nuo doesn't want him to eat at home. Okay. I will be right there. Nona, Uncle made a favorite french fries for you. Tio, take a break. Or maybe you should go back first. I just want to cook a meal for you and Nona. Yes, I came here today with purpose. She, after all these years, can't you see whether my love for you is genuine? You're still thinking about Li Jiayue. When you were in life-threatening situation abroad, where was he? When Nona was sick and you had no one to turn to, where was he? Where are the mugs, Nona? Where was he? She, I want to take care of you and Nona, okay? Give me a chance. I will do well. Dad! Nona. Go wait for daddy in the car. Dad has something to take care of. I will take you and mom home later. Okay. Mr. Lee, listen to me. Call me husband. Didn't I warn you? Stay away from my woman. You are just relying on a few measly dollars to show off everywhere. Did you ask she? If she still wants to be with you, I'm the one who loves her with all my heart. So she won't be happy with you. Li Chaiyuan, Li Chaiyuan! Do you have to cause a tragedy before you stop? I'll go with you, okay? Handle your own woman yourself. Go, Dad! Candlelight dinner with another man. What are you angry about? It's me who should be angry. This is... You once said that you wanted to decorate the room like this. I remember it all. Over there is the kids room for our son. Also designed according to your ideas. Xiao Xi, I- Stop talking. A child should sleep in the children's room. Good night, mom and dad. Good night. It seems that tonight my wife can only make do with me. Don't you have any other rooms here? No. I'll sleep in the sofa. Go inside. No. I will sleep on the sofa. <laughs> will you really? Dad! Chen Xiaoxi, do you really want to avoid me so much? I'll give you one day. I want to stay in here. Mom? Mr. Lee, thank you for taking us home. We can stop here. We'll go inside ourselves. You said I was giving you a ride. So you are... Going home. Since when did you start living here? Hello, new neighbor. Nice to meet you. Sam, 
Come over and to play. Chen Xiaoxi came back home with me. Still thinking of sneaking out? Fine. Then I will move next door to you. Let's see which man dares to provoke you. Sister, what are you doing here? Where did you take Xiao Ye? How did you know that? Think about the people under your command. Who else would they listen to besides you? Grandpa. Grandpa knows she's back. Her specifically asked me to remind you this woman wants to marry into the lease. No way. Just like back then. Grandpa's words have been delivered. You can leave now. Li Chaiyuan, you are too cruel. Xiao Ye is scared to come back because of you. Xiao Ye loves you so much compared to this woman. I don't know how many times stronger she is. Even Grandpa approves. Are you blind? I'm blind. That's why I believed her lies. Letting Xiao Ye suffer for so many years. What do you mean? What? Didn't she tell you? I will go explain to Grandpa. I advise you to stay away from Xin Xiaoyue. If Grandpa finds out, it's because of her that he couldn't recognize his only grandson. He'll be even harsher than me. Who knows where she brought that illegitimate child from? Too dare to admit him? Women like Chen Xiaoxi. Shut up! Don't insult Xiaoxi. Psycho. Mom, are you eavesdropping? It's a dog's matter. Don't interfere. How's it going? I think he's determined to be with that woman. From what I heard, he is certain that the child is his. What did Grandpa say? He doesn't know about the grandson yet. Jai, we must not let Grandpa know that a grandson exists. What? Think about it. The woman's strong willed. Li Jiawen hasn't even announced the existence of the child yet. It means he definitely hasn't won over Chen Xiaoxi. Grandpa is getting old. If he finds out about grandson, he will leave all his property to him. Then he will have nothing left. You care so much about the property of the lease. Could it be that you are with me for money? I'm worried. Worried that as Li's daughter. You will have nothing in the end and be despised by others. Fine, I believe you. Jia Yi, you must believe my love for you has no impurities. So what should I do now? Find a way to contact Miss Qing first. I will make sure you get everything you deserve. Noah's cooking skills are getting better. Come, Mom will reward you with a kiss. I made this breakfast. Your kiss can be rewarded to me. What are you doing here? Nono asked me to come over. I didn't see anything. No, how can you open the door to a stranger? How did mom teach you about this? Mom, dad is not a stranger. But still, it's not allowed. Mom is angry. Mom is clearly very happy. Mom shouldn't lie. Come here. I won't. Dad, protect me. All right, let's eat breakfast now. Otherwise, you will be late for school. Thank you, Dad. I'm starving. What's with the changing attitude when our son leaves? Li Chaiyuan. You deliberately approached me and Noah like this. What exactly are you after? I just want to take care of you and our son. There is really no need for it. You are living very well now. I don't want to continue this entanglement with you. What happened back then was just a misunderstanding. Why can't you give me the opportunity to explain? Listen to your explanation about how you ended up with Xin Xiaoye back then. I was framed. Do you think I'm stupid? Why didn't you say so back then? Have you given me the opportunity to explain? You didn't even answer my calls. I didn't answer your calls, but couldn't you try harder to reach me? You had an ambiguous relationship with Zhou Fei back then. You even went abroad with him. So, this is the truth, isn't it? You never believed me. I don't believe you. Have you ever trusted me? Li Jiayuan, I won't go back with you. And I don't want to marry into the lease. Maybe. You were framed back then. But this also proves that our relationship isn't blessed by your family. This makes me feel too... Release me! Let go of me! I won't. You will run away again. Let go of me! I'll answer the phone!
消息 ，There is an alumni gathering this weekend. You and No No can come together.、Oh, hey. Our family of three will arrive on time. Childish. I really let you go once back then. This time, we definitely won't miss you again. 小西 ，It's really you, 小西。Who is this? Oh, this is my husband. Boss, you're married. I. Our child is already six years old. Hello, Auntie. I heard a couple of years ago that you and she were abroad together. Your child is six years old. You were already married back then. I'm not. She hasn't been in a relationship all these years. Isn't it all because of you? And you, you got married and still persistently cling to him. Zhen Xiaoxi, you've gone too far. Someone else has gone too far. Mr. Chu knew that Xiaoxi was pregnant, yet he kept bothering her repeatedly. As the father of the child, I have been very generous. I heard that today Mr. Chu organized a class reunion. Considering the unpleasant experience I had with him, I brought my wife and child to explain things to him. This young lady, could you please move out of the way? So、hey, Xiao Xi's here. You should still remember this person. Come over and have、Don't、a seat.、Her. Is this Mister Li from Jiaoyuan Group? Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Everyone, please have a seat. Xiao Xi, this is your fault, isn't it? When did you get in touch with Mr. Li without even saying a word? So what if I have contact with Mr. Li? Rich people looking for women is like playing games. They don't like the someone like Chen Xiaoxi. Are they really interested in her? She was so good to you, and you didn't cherish it. You rushed to become a rich man's plaything. If they get bored with you, you will be thrown away like garbage. You, a mind-minded woman, will face consequences. My dad is not that kind of person. You're not allowed to say. That about my mom. No, don't be so rude. Sit. Yeah, kid. Your mother admitted it herself. Tell Chelsea, you will regret losing you. That's enough. Don't embarrass Chelsea. Let her make her own choice. Chelsea has no other choice but to be my wife in this lifetime. Who are you to make decisions for Chelsea? Looks like you didn't get enough beating last time. Oh, Gu is here, but Gu may not be willing to help you. Oh, I have a meeting. I will leave you guys to it. Mister Cho, relationships should be based on mutual affection. Even if you take it by force, you still need capital. You have neither Xiao Xi's affection for you nor the capital. I kindly remind you that intervening in someone else's marriage will only bring shame upon yourself. I bring shame upon myself. Xiao Xi, I just ask you once: Will you choose him or choose me? Xiao Xi, I. What's wrong with her? I don't know. Chen Xiao Xi, can't you let go of Li Jiao Yuan? I've wasted so many years of my feelings for nothing. Why? Hello, I am Mr. Da Vinci's assistant. Regarding the artworks you sent earlier, there is one piece that Mr. Da Vinci really likes. We would like to use it in the exhibition in City A. Can you give me the contact information of the artist of this work? It's me. You can tell me directly. Chen Xiaoxi, you are ruthless. Don't blame me for being heartless. Does your mom always lock you out of room when she's angry? My mom didn't do this before. It's because of you, Dad. If your mom gets angry, how do you solve it? My mom usually doesn't get angry with me. What if she does? Do you have any ideas? Yes. 
best. I overheard last time that Mom wanted to go to an art exhibition, but couldn't get tickets. Thank you, Nono. What's the matter, Xiaoxi? This painting. Miss, do you like this painting? May I ask who the artist of this painting is? Excuse me, are you a VIP customer? I'm sorry, but our artist meet and greet event is only for VIP customers of the exhibition. This painting is my work. Your work? May I have your name, please? Chen Xiaoxi. Sorry, I don't have your name. I would like to see your person in charge. Just casually, you don't just want to meet our person in charge. If you cause any trouble, I'll call security. Take this card and swipe it until we become your VIP. She wouldn't lie. If she says the painting is hers, it must be hers. Okay, just a moment. I'll tell you two to attend our artist meet and group and then arrange for you to meet separately. <laughs> Mr. Chu, these two guests want to meet you. Chu, why did you use my painting without permission? As your brother Chu, do I need to use your painting? But I did give you that painting. You also said you were sending it to Mr. Da Vinci as a backup piece for the exhibition. And now, it's in Mr. Da Vinci's art exhibition. Shouldn't you explain it to me? Indeed, I still don't understand you enough. Now it's not like when you were crying your eyes out after being cheated on by that man. He got your backer, and now he turned your back on people. Chen Xiaoxi, I underestimated you. Two, these are two different things. Which gentleman is buying all the paintings here? It's you? Yo, Xiaoxi, long time no see. I remember the last time we met overseas. I told you, you were talented. Are you still painting now? Sir, thank you for your help back then. I am now working as a designer in a listed company. This is my... Hello, I'm Chen Xiaoxi's current boss. Why aren't you playing by the rules? Are you having a change of heart now? Do you miss the time when I call myself your husband? Nonsense. The old man looks strict and serious. If I said I'm your husband, he would definitely think I'm a biased. If he wants some sweet words, Wait until I get painting back. It's you who wants to buy all the pennies here. It's me. But before that, I would like Mr. Da Vinci to be a witness. You are Mr. Da Vinci? Witness? What kind of witness? Witness the authenticity of a painting. I've always respected the literary and the artistic creation, since both my staff and Mr. Cho think that the painting in your exhibition belongs to them. Paint it again, and let you, sir, be the judge of to whom this painting truly belongs. Okay, no problem. Sir, what are you afraid of? Did you really take something that belongs to someone else? Come on. Chu, you have put in a lot of effort to imitate my work. You must have practiced for quite some time. Xiaoxi, that's not true. This is clearly my work. Also, you imitated it in form. You couldn't capture its essence. Is that so? Mr. Da Vinci didn't say anything. Why are you talking nonsense here? The secret of the moon. It's interesting. No wonder it looked familiar to me from the beginning. Chu Fei, you are a liar. How dare you use someone else's painting? Don't show your face in this circle anymore. Why do you say it's not my painting? Others may not see it, but unfortunately you encountered me. This is a special painting technique of mine. Only recorded it in my book. And I happen to be a fan of Mr. Da Vinci. I collect every book of his, and this painting was also made by me to pay tribute to Mr. Da Vinci. What do you have to say? What else to tell him? I've already called the police. Xiaoxi, Xiaoxi, it's my fault. Forgive me this time. You know she will forgive you, and you still say you like her. Using her weakness to deceive her and hurt her. Even if Xiaoxi lets you go, I'm not gonna let you go. Xiaoxi, I'm responsible for this too. I didn't check the painting properly. I'm very ashamed. Teacher, don't say that. Ah, 
Since the gentleman bought the painting for the sake of Xiao Xi, now that the truth has come to light, I don't think you need to spend any money. That's okay. I bought the painting for Xiao Xi. I haven't asked yet. Li Jiayuan of Jiayuan International. Mr. Li, nice to meet you. As compensation, please allow me to take Xiao Xi to meet our colleagues and introduce her to them.